It is an absolutely beautiful day today in Bali. We're just going down to the breakfast buffet and then we'll be packing up and checking out at I think 11. Not too sure what we're gonna get up to today. Probably gonna hit the beach. Jaden's just at the airport right now coming to Bali. So we'll be meeting up with him later. But yeah, just gonna have a nice calm day, look around, probably try to figure out what we're gonna do for the next week or so. The bed and the room was awesome. Uh, really needed a place like that to stay after staying in hostels for the past three weeks. It was a really nice change. I didn't take advantage of it as much as I should have, like Graydon did, but uh, you know, I got an eight hours of good sleep, so that's good enough for me. So, trying out some guava juice. It's, uh, it's pretty damn good. You got some juice water. Uh, there's a bunch of other things I haven't taken a look yet, but uh, you know, obtuse rubber goose, and green mousse, and guava juice. So this breakfast buffet is awesome. We got some fried rice, we got some pasta, green beans, watermelon, papaya, some banana bread, a couple of little like danishes and uh, some sweets. It looks it looks delicious. And we got some toast coming and some eggs are coming for us too. After having a breakfast like this and a room like that and a pool like that, it's not gonna be easy to go back to the hostel life. <laughs> just finished our delicious breakfast buffet. Uh, now we're just gonna hang out and maybe edit and just enjoy our room while we, we have it. And then we will be checking out at 12 and heading out, I guess, to our new hostel. Jaden's plane is delayed, so we're probably not gonna be meeting him to like 4 o'clock instead now, which kind of sucks for him. But then we'll show them around and show them all the great beaches in there. So we just checked out of the beautiful Hermatakuta. Had a great stay there. I believe it was only $18 each for one night for our suite. And it was it was great. It was a really nice change from hostels. Uh, good place to stay if you want to be near the airport. Highly recommend staying there. Breakfast was great. Everything was, it was just a good stay, really nice. Now we are on our way to our hostel. It's about a 40 minute walk from where we are. Uh, our check-in is at 1, it's 12 o'clock right now, so we'll probably uh, get there around and check-in, perfect timing. We're probably going to be hitting the beach today, whether it's for sunset or just to hang out. But it looked absolutely gorgeous last night in the dark, so I can't wait to see what it looks like with the sun out. We're going to be spending a day or two here at Kuta, and then I think we're going to be heading off to Kangu. I believe that's how you say it, I'm not too sure. We've heard really good things about there from uh, one of our buddies back home, so we're going to be checking that out, who knows how long we'll be there, and then who knows where we're going to be going from there. It is stupid hot today. Uh, we're just pouring sweat walking to our next hostel. When we were in Chiang Mai, it got up to like 40 degrees, but uh, it feels hotter here and it's only 32. Just went for a nice little walk along the beach. Now we are on the quest for food. We uh, were thinking about going back to where we were yesterday, but we decided we just want to grab food as close as we can. Just uh, grabbing some burgers here. It's not the cheapest place, but it looks like it's delicious and we want some food right by the beach. The burgers we got were absolutely delicious, but uh, they were definitely overpriced for what we ended up getting. So I think we're gonna be trying to stick to uh, cheaper areas like we were yesterday. It was super good and super cheap. We uh, just did a little bit of shopping at a market. I got a hat for just under $4 Canadian. Uh, Aiden got some glasses and a new beater. And Graydon got a fanny pack of glasses. Did you get a beater too? And Graydon got a beater as well. So I think we did pretty good. He was saying everything in the store was $5. And um, I just told him I didn't have five dollars and it worked out. I've done that trick before and for bartering it's not a bad one at all. Just walking around the Beach Walk Mall here. Um, we have been hunting for the Dairy Queen which we finally got to. And just looking through stores, checking it out. Like 
This is a nice mall. It'd be really cool if it was at home because all the prices are the same as at home, so it doesn't make a big difference to buy stuff here unless you're buying from markets. Just sat at a bar and listened to some live music for about an hour or so. Uh, now we were just walking back and some little girls are probably like five or six ran up to us with bracelets trying to get us to buy them. We're in a hostel now. Just gonna have a little three bed dip in the pool. And then we'll probably just hang out on our phones, talk to people, but that's gonna be it for the day. Uh, pretty fun, just hanging out. I think tomorrow we're gonna be hitting the beach. And then the next day we're probably gonna be moving on to Kangoo which is a town nearby that apparently is super sick. So, I'll see you in the next video.